this is their sewage system right here. Their bathroom. Hello, hello, hello. Somebody come up. <laughs> All right, here we go. I really hope. This isn't the time where the bridge breaks and I fall in the poop water. All right, so far so good. More sturdy than I thought. So this is their sewage system right here. Their bathroom, it goes right into the water. And I've seen places like this before. Usually it's just a hole in their in their floor and then right next to the kitchen which is also the living room and then they just shit right into the water Saudi cop You would think that these people are like, what the hell is this guy doing in my front yard or in my house? But no, they're like really happy to, uh, you know, see people. Okay, there's nothing down there. They're like, I don't know. Like, hello, hello, how are you? You know, I mean, they don't speak much English, but you can tell by their body language <clears throat> that they're friendly. And they don't think it's weird or anything that you're walking through their homes. I, I guess it's kind of just like walking through a neighborhood, you know, like a public neighborhood <laughs> in any other country. Saudi cop? Uh, Kamala, uh, my pen or I? Chai mai? Samrap ni? Kamala, samrap ni? Okay? Okay. Bird? Bird? Uh, Bird? Uh. Okay, cop. Oh, guy. Okay. Uh, Hello, am I? Hello. Oh. <laughs> Swai mak. Swai mak. <laughs> Set ili. Okay, cop, cop. Okay. Nung, nung. Oh, uh. cop. Now they're giving me chicken. Mmm. Hello, Mark. So this is the setup here. Right. Huh? Oh, rice. Uh. Okay. Oh. Uh. <laughs> D D D. D D D. Oh. Good chicken, also. Wow. Not bad. So, this is how they live. Now uh, I just gotta pay them. Just let me reach in my pocket here. Katod, katod. Some lap guy. Chai. Oh. Chai. And uh. No, 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 my, 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 my. My uncle. Okay, okay. Stop. Okay, thank you so much. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, bye bye, bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> All right. Okay, off we go to the next person's house for some food. <laughs> wow, good chicken. I don't know if they think I'm insane <laughs> or what. They probably don't get a lot of like random white people that just like walk into their house with a camera. Be like, hey, hello, what are you, what are you, what are you doing? Can I record you cooking? <laughs> what I wanted to do is kind of walk along the river. That way I could see everything and because it's a big slum. I mean, it's not like the same slums of, I don't know, other countries, India, Brazil, of course, but they're slums. So this is an example of how their places are built, you know, just out of whatever pieces of trash they can find.
Oh, there's a little doggy down there. Hey yo. Hey yo, hey yo. Come here. Oh no. God, we got a cautious one. So Bangkok is the capital of the country and it makes up for 50% of the GDP with uh, about 10% of the population. So it's a booming economy <clears throat> and with a lot of poverty, but it is getting better. Hello, Saudi Cup. It's a lot better since the 80s. It went from 67% poverty to now only about 7% of people living below the poverty line. But it could be more than that. Hello. <clears throat> you know, that's just what, that figure is just what the government considers below the poverty line. So it might be a lot more. And then right behind these slums, in sight, we got all the big corporations back there sucking the life out of the people. I mean, that's kind of the reason the people are living in these conditions because of poor economic policies and, and greed. You know, and the rich stay rich, and the poor stay poor. And it doesn't mean that these people don't have any money at all. I mean, they have money, they have businesses, you know, they have motorbikes, they have cars, but they're definitely living in extreme poverty. <laughs> hello, hello, hello. Saudi cop. Oh, Samsung. <laughs> That just shows how friendly people are. I mean, he smiled and waved and he was like, hey, how's it going? You know, while I'm with my camera, a tourist making a YouTube video. In a lot of places you go in other countries, they'll be like, why is he here? You, you need to leave, get the fuck out of my neighborhood. You know, they're like, hey, hey, what's up? Oh boy. So this place looks like it used to be somebody's house. Probably not anymore. God, there's puppies in there. Oh, a rat down there. Yeah, there's puppies living in here. Oh my God. Oh, this poor dog is scared. Oh, hey. This definitely is uh, kind of heartbreaking when you think about it, you know? If you don't think about it, then, well, you don't think about it. When you think about it, oh, when you think about living here and what it's like to live here. Oh boy. Saudi cop. At least the minimum wage was just raised up to uh, about ten dollars per day. Saudi cop. <laughs> Lots of shit.
All right, guys, I think I'm gonna end the video here. That was quite an experience. I hope it wasn't too depressing to watch, but I gotta come check it out if I'm in Bangkok, you know, just to see what it's like. Showcase the living conditions for the people, for the viewers. And you can come check it out for yourself if you're in Bangkok. Um, I'll uh, put a link in the description to show the location that we started at and how to find this place. Hope you got some value out of the video. I got a lot more coming. Stay tuned. Subscribe to the channel. All right, guys. That's all.